Hi everyone, Fabian's Media Corner 2001, and today I have another collection for y'all. This is going to be on my Power Rangers VHS DVD and Blu-ray collection. And as you can see, I got quite a ton here. A few DVDs and a, a Blu-ray. Hoping to get some more DVDs uh, in the coming future. I'm going to start with all the clam sh clamshell tapes I have, and then my three uh, slipcover tapes. So let's go hang get this going. I'm going to start with my 20th Century Fox tapes. We will start with this one first. This is the 1995 VHS of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers the movie. Really good movie right here. One of my favorites. Oh, and here's the tape for it. Predates the 42nd week of 1995. Okay, next we're gonna go with the, the 1927 VHS of Power Rangers Light Speed Rescue, Titanium Ranger, Ranger Curse of the Cor Corba. This was put in the 36th week of 2000, so this is a... Uh, appears to be a reprint, because it, it says 2000 on the label. So, I want to check on this one again. And here we have the 2001 VHS of Time Force. Voice from the future. Okay, and here's the tape for it. The part date on it is uh, May 13th, 2001. Also from 2001, Lightspe Rescue, The Queen's Wrath. Yeah, some of these uh, tapes have some good set of episodes on them. And a few specials here and there, no? Print date on this. February tenth, two thousand one. Is the print date on this. <clears throat> also from two thousand one. Time Force. Quantum Ranger. Clash for Comfort. Control. Okay, this one is printed on. Mm. Looks like July 10th, 2001. Alright, here we have another movie Terrible a Power Rangers movie. This tape's from 1997. This is one of the few Power Rangers movies I have not seen yet gonna check this out uh, next weekend possible
to print dates, 21st week of 1997, 40th week of 1999, recycle tape. So it looks like this is a reprint. Okay, now we're going to go to the Disney titles. <clears throat> we have Lost Galaxy, The Return of the Magma Defender. This was one of the few Power Rangers uh, series I grew up watching back in the day. Lost Galaxy is one of my favorite uh, Power Rangers series. Yeah, I gotta love Lost Galaxy. Alright, and here's the tape for you with the blue lid. And print dates uh, December 14th, 2002, December 19th, 2002. It's got two actually. Also from 2002, The End of Time. This one just has a black lid this time. Print May 28th, 2002. This has got to be the most rarest tape in my collection, and I'm proud to have it. Red Alert. Yeah, this contains three different uh, Power Rangers, uh, Red Ranger episodes from various uh, series. Yeah, not bad for a compilation tape. I really enjoy this one. Blue lid. Print on October 4th, 2002. Alright, next up we're gonna go with Wild Force. Identity Crisis. Blue Lid. This is actually a Canadian tape. <clears throat> and so it's got a cartridge number 51 out of 57. Here's another Wild Force tape. It's uh, Ancient Awakening. Now this one's got a dark stick label on it, and a plain black lid. Cartridge number out of 15 out of 21. <sighs> Alright, we're gonna go to the 2003 VHS of Ninja Storm, probably to a storm. Blue lid again. This one has a crack on it. Tape's been tested. It works. Print on May 5th, 2003. Okay, this next one. This next one does not have its case. Uh, its cover, rather. But this is also from 2003. Samurai's Journey. Cartridge number 5 out of 5. 
This one never had a case because uh, when I got this, uh, this one, this tape was actually inside this case when I got it out of a uh, lot bundle on eBay. Then uh, a few years later, found a copy with this without a case. So now it's a uh, correct set of tape stands in here. So that's why this one never had a case. So. Luckily, it was one of the few Ninja Storm tapes I didn't have in my collection yet, which was good. I'm just glad to have the, you know, correct tape in here after all these years. So, so that's why this one never had a cover. So. Also from 2003, Cyber Clash. It's another Ninja Storm tape. And possibly if you want to read the episodes, I don't feel like uh, going into detail on those today. Blue lid. <clears throat> cartridge number one out of five. So the tapes with the cartridge numbers are uh, Canadian tapes. <clears throat> and finally, for all the clamshells, all four of the uh, Dino Thunder tapes. Here is Volume 1, Day of the Dino. This is from 2004. I think all of them are from 2004. I'll check on my uh, app again. Let me pull it out right here. My collection app. <clears throat> Blue lid. Cartridge number uh, 2 out of 9. Volume 2, Legacy of Power. Blue lid. <clears throat> and the cartridge number is 3 out of 7. Volume 3, White Thunder. This is the only one that's a U.S. tape. Volumes, volumes 1, 2, and 4 were all Canadian tapes, but this is the only one that's a, an American tape. Blue Lid, and the Black Rails, and uh, they do squeak. See how I could hear that. Print September 4th, 2004. So, uh, here pretty soon. This tape will soon be, uh, 18 years old. Check on that again. Yeah, this tape will soon be 18 years old. Here's the final one in the clamshell, and it's, uh, Collision Cores, Volume 4. Yeah, all of the Dino Thunder tapes are from 2004. <clears throat> this time, this one has a black lid, but it's still got the, you know, the squeaky black reels. Yeah. Okay, cartridge number 2002. Now, we're gonna go for the slipcovers. <clears throat> We have Power Rangers Holiday Special from 2000. With these episodes listed down here. This one is printed on uh, October 23rd, 2000. Don't even focus there. That's the print date. Here's a very rare one. This is from 2002, and it's Power Rangers in 3D. 
This is a uh, Power Rangers uh, 3D Triple Force. Yeah, this one's a former rental from Hollywood video. You can see by those stickers there. This is actually the Disney version. And what's rare about this, I got my own set of 3D glasses, by the way. Uh, anyway, uh, what's rare about this, this is a blue cassette. Yeah, not very many copies of this are blue cassettes, so I got lucky. Printed on November 11th, 2003. Seven days before my second birthday, around that time. Yeah, I got my own set of 3D glasses for my copy of the tape. Didn't have any, it was just the tape itself. Really nice tape to watch, especially with the 3D glasses. Makes it even better. All right, here is my last tape. This one appears to be from 1993, and it's a, a Mighty Morphin Power Rangers tape. High five. This one's volume two, so I'm missing the other volumes. The case is not in the best condition, but the tape's a okay shape. All right, here's the tape. This is a Canadian tape. The oversized reels and this kind of label, and no print date. That's all my tapes. Now we're gonna go to the the DVDs. I'm gonna show off this one. This is the 2021 set of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the complete series. This is a box set. I have acquired this uh, sometime this year. Show you what's all gotten here. <clears throat> so here we have the first season, complete first season. This one was released in 2015, and here are the discs. Pause if you want to read all of this stuff. The episodes. Yeah, this this individual DVD is from 2015. Oh, what's this? Ah, there's more. Also. 2016 actually. This is the complete second season. Alright. Looks like this one's uh, also six discs. Just like the first season. Oh. Uh oh. That's not good. Okay, everything's okay with this disc. <clears throat> okay, and this one's uh 2012, season three, complete third season. So that's kind of odd. <clears throat> anyway. There are the discs. And this one's got a bonus DVD. This is actually Mighty Morphin Alien Rangers. This is a Power Rangers spinoff. With only 10 episodes. So this was a, a mini-series. <clears throat> yeah, I said right there. So that's kind of cool. <clears throat> OK. 
Okay. <clears throat> Next up, we have the 2015 DVD of my favorite series, Lost Galaxy. This is the complete series. Definitely love this series. Finally, the only Blu-ray, which is the 2017 Blu-ray of Power Rangers, the 2017 movie. This one I have seen. This was really good. <clears throat> Again, I just need to see Turbo. Then I think I've pretty much seen uh, most of the Power Rangers movies I know that I have. Right, here's the... Both the Blu-ray and the DVD have the same design. Here's this code if y'all want it. I can't guarantee if it'll work or not, or if it's been used. I might have shown this off in an update somewhere. And there's this. For Power Rangers uh, Legacy War, so in the app. I'm not sure if this is still around, but... There's that. And... This concludes my Power Rangers VHS DVD and Blu-ray collection. Thank you guys for watching. Take care. This is Fabian's Media Corner 2001 sending out.